Yo guys, it's Hayden here to bring to you another GTA 5 video and to bring to you guys how to do the treasure hunt that just released in GTA 5 online. And all you guys want, this can get you the dual, dual uh, revolver, which is I think only out at this time during the Christmas holidays. is really good. One shot to the head, really awesome revolver. So I'm just going to get straight into it and show you guys what to do. So all you guys want to do is go into a GTA 5 online session. Once you guys, once you guys load into a GTA 5 online session, you guys are going to want to drive around. And while driving around... And I think within five to ten minutes, you guys should get a message with an email about a treasure hunt, and you'll get a picture. I think there's ten. Um, you guys will see in a second. The picture I got was the picture of the broken bridge in Polito Bay. So what you guys are gonna want to do is you guys want to go to that location, and you guys are gonna want to uh, look around for a note. And there's a um, this note has a bunch of stuff from Trevor. It says, "Oh, you can't find this treasure or whatever." Um, I'll show you guys exactly what it says, but then. Uh, you guys just want to look at it and then just get off of it and right click on the d-pad and it's going to show you but i'll get more in detail i'll show you guys in the scenario and yeah so hope you guys enjoy the video leave a like comment subscribe if you guys enjoy and yeah i'm going to straight into it so this is the picture first of all um it is the um i just explained the Boca bridge and now i'm going to just cut out the entire drive there because it's literally a seven mile drive it took me a long time to get there so i'll catch you guys right when i get there Okay guys, so I arrived and I was just walking around and I see uh, something popped up for me to go right in the d-pad and the note, this is the note, um, you guys can read it there if you guys want to pause the video, but uh, it says treasure hunt started and now you got, it'll show the uh, three locations, there's one, and then I unpause it because it didn't, I paused it too quick, and it does show the three locations and they're the same for everybody. The only things that are different, that might be different for you and your friend, are the location you have to start at and the location you have to finish at because... I started in Polito Bay, and you guys will see that at the end, end in Polito Bay. So I'm going to go, I'm going to start with the first uh, checkpoint, and then I will show you guys what item you find and where to find it. So yeah, I'll meet you guys when I get there. Okay guys, so basically you guys want to go to the first checkpoint in Great Valley, and you guys want to see this big tree here, and you guys want to go up to it, and you guys will see just the empty case for the revolver. So that is the first clue of the treasure hunt, and now I'm going to get to the second clue. Okay guys, so now for the second clue, you guys are going to want to go to the Great Valley second checkpoint, and you guys are going to want to go to the right side of this. You guys will see this chair here, and then you'll see a bloody shovel next to it. You guys just want to look at it there, whatever, exit, and you guys have two out of three clues discovered. So, I'm going to bring you guys to the last clue, and we'll go from there. Okay guys, so we are pushing the third location for the uh, third clue, so all you guys want to do is go, it is the mountain location, you guys will see it's the only one separated, is the farthest, furthest one from the other two. So you just want to go up this mountain, you guys will see a little hole there, and when you guys go through this little hole, you guys will see a dead body there, you guys want to look at the dead body, and you got your third clue. There you go, just got his underwear, shoes, I don't know, must have got jumped, he's got half a head, no clue, but now we're gonna, so now... Uh, I just had to wait. I wasn't very patient, so I opened up the menu too quick. This is where my friend actually had to go. He actually had to go to, I think it was, yeah, Sandy Shores was his um, start and his finish. Um, but mine was all the way at the top of the map in Polito Bay where I started. So I'm going to have to go there, and I'll meet you guys when I get there. Okay, guys, so I am approaching the location in Polito Bay. So uh, all you guys want to do is just it's over here it tells you exactly where it is actually um it mine was in the middle of a bunch of rocks there was the two guys there and then right in the middle was my revolver and yeah guys that's really it so you guys have the revolver and in my next video that's gonna be right after this you guys are gonna see how to get the two hundred fifty thousand dollars uh why while using this weapon you all you have to do is get 50 headshots so stay tuned for my next video and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out